Hello and welcome everyone. I'm Dick. Let's continue our journeys. Episode 18, Pages from a Book Hey, I'm feeling good now. You didn't have to come back. I need to tell you something and it can't wait anymore. What? I've been lying to you cautiously. Adam, I've loved you with all my heart for years. You're the person I want to build my life with. And that's why I need to be completely honest with you. I'm worried now. Is there something you haven't told me? I didn't do it because I thought it was for the best. Remember that. The best for you, not for Adam. Are you going to tell me or... Just minutes before you had the accident, you proposed to me. I did? Yes, and I didn't respond well. We argued, you left angry. And you got hit by a car while you were venting on the phone with Patrick. Wow, thanks for the preamble, but this is very intense. I thought about telling you before, but I was afraid I'd lose you. I need to be alone for a while. Please, listen to me. I think I've heard enough. Are you angry? No, it's not anger. I'm confused. I need time and space to process all this. Sure, talk to me when you're ready. Adam going into space for real now. Katie, will you marry me? No. Are you serious? Now? Yes, of course I'm serious. It's not the reaction I expected from you. I'm sorry. It's just that today was the worst day of my life. The worst day. I see. Can I ask you a question? No offense, please, but... Who are you? No one. I can't talk right now, Emily. Yeah, push your friend aside. You knew? Yes, but I couldn't say anything. It wasn't my place. You understand. It's Patrick, come on. I get it, man. I wouldn't have said anything either. But I can't help but feel distressed by this news. At least things are starting to clear up. I assure you, Katie was devastated when it all happened. Tell him to forgive her. Katie loves him. Katie loves you. It was just a misunderstanding. I don't think love will solve this. Yesterday my head was killing me. Now I understand it was my feelings because of the ring. All I can tell you is that your relationship has always been intense. Katie always managed to get you out of your comfort zone. And that's what made you fall in love with her. Now I understand why I called you to vent that time. Get some rest buddy and call me if you need anything. Thank you. I have a lot to think about. How long have you been waiting for me outside? Not long. Why didn't you answer the phone? I couldn't. I don't know if it was shame, disappointment, sadness. Anton told me what happened and that's why I called. I think it's all over now, Emily. I don't think our relationship can be safe. Thanks for all your help. I'll be by your side then, whatever happens. I'll keep helping you with whatever you need. You can count on me. You're the best friend I could have. I'll spend the night with you and I won't take no for an answer. It'll do me good to have someone pass me the tissues. Oh, sweetie, I'll cry every tear with you. I feel some relief, you know. Adam knows everything. 
The ball is in his court. What? The ball is in his court. A few days later. What? What is this? A surprise. Do you like it? Of course. But why? You always surprise me. I felt it was my turn. Were you going out? Yes, today is my last day of classes. I have to go to the bar and talk to suppliers. Can I work with you? Yes! Since you're not going to have classes, you can spend more time at the bar. I don't want to take up all your time. I could actually use the company. Do you need a waitress? No, just company. Are you sure because I was a waitress at a bar in California? Really? Yes, and I also know how to make tequila. You can make tequila? You could help me with ideas for the bar. I'd love that. Here we are. Thanks for the surprise and for the flowers. How are you today? I assume you already know about the marriage proposal. Yes. No hard feelings? I already processed that with Patrick. Do you want to talk about something? To be honest, I'm still thinking about Katie, but I find it all so confusing. I need clarity. I want to try with Nadia. Wow, I did not expect you to make up your mind so soon. Excuse me, I have to take this call. You can take it in the office. Hi, Mariel. What do you want? Thanks for taking the time to see me. You're still my publisher? Yes, I'm still reading. And I noticed that there are parts of the story that you don't remember. Yes, there are situations I don't remember. But I gave it another spin. Yes, but it still feels incomplete. I don't know what to do, Mariel. I try to force myself to remember, but... And I understand your situation, but I need to finish the book. It's the only way I can get my investment back. What do you want me to do? Have you tried to talk to Katie about this? She was always there with you. She knows everything about your book. We are not in a good place in our relationship right now. I understand. Well, I'll see what I can do. There is no relationship anymore, right? Did I miss something? I have to finish the novel, but there are parts I don't remember. Mariel was just here. She said I should talk to Katie. So why don't you? There's something I didn't tell you. I'm trying to focus on Nadia, but it's hard for me. Katie is always present in my mind. And what do you think it means? What I told you, confusion, right? But if she walked through that door now, would you be happy or not? Headache, more headache. Of course I would, very much. His head's gonna explode. How is Adam? I think it's over forever. That's not possible. If you don't mind, let's focus on work. All right. I want us to formalize our partnership. Sure, you can pass on more responsibilities to me. She's so smart. She knew. Katie using her. Katie, I need to talk to you now. What's the matter, Mariel? Adam needs your help finishing the novel. What can I do? You were with him on the trip. You have to help him remember. And he's okay with this. We are not in a good place. He said the same thing. But I saw in his eyes that he does want to do it. Are you sure? That's a big guess. We both know you're in his mind. He just can't find you. 
I don't want to meddle in your personal affairs, but you could take this opportunity to get close to him. Well, thank you for your advice, Mariel. I'll help him then. Hope that works. It's the perfect time to show him my support. Hello. Hello. This is weird, isn't it? Yes, but thank you for agreeing to help me. It's the least I can do for you. I suggested you come because all your stuff is here. What is that? Some of your notes about the trip. I can make coffee and we can read them. Sounds perfect. Did we really dress like the nobility? And we were in the middle of a war between two kingdoms. Are you sure you're not making it up? I'll never forget the smell of the palace alcoves, a mixture of wood and old roses. Yes, the whole palace smelled like old roses. Is my memory coming back or is it just my imagination? Maybe both. Now I remember, that's why my main character grows flowers. To leave them on his lover's bed every night. That's right. So it's still a fiction. Thanks for agreeing to do this with me. I've agreed to do a lot worse with you. It's true, it's crazy what you did in Sinargel. I couldn't have done it without you by my side. Where else would you like to go? I've always liked places with mountains. Me too, and I feel like I haven't been to many. How about an adventure in the middle of the jungle? What? In jeep caravans? Yes, and eating in the middle of nowhere. You mean the ocean? Now you have ideas for another book. You can't say I wasn't helpful. I honestly can't. Thank you. I'll leave you with your creativity now. Good. Stay professional. To the greatest partnership of all time. The deal of a lifetime. Cheers. I like the lawyer. Where did you find him? Some friends recommended him. I'm sorry, I didn't do this before. We're doing it now. Yes, and I'm happy about that. Although, is that the ring Adam gave you? I'll always need him. Today, we look at each other in a way that gave me hope. That did me good. Toss the ring into the Mount Doom. Here's to your novel. My ex helped me finish it. I'm telling you because I don't want secrets between us. That's fine with me. I have a few weeks off. What do you say we go on a trip? Say yes, Adam. It's vacation. Thank you everyone for watching. Have a wonderful day. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And see you guys on our next journeys.